hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel we are here for another asos haul asos haul Finally, my goods arrived. They arrived, guys. In case you're wondering, when were they supposed to arrive? They were supposed to arrive in December. December, you guys, my guys. December. They were supposed to be Christmas stuff. <laughs> Woo! Postal Services of Kenya will let you see things. They will let you see things. They will teach you patience. They will give you character development when it comes to patience. Yeah? Poster. Poster will teach you patience. <laughs> yes. But anyway, all in all, they arrived. Yes, they arrived in January, mid-January. Uh, around uh, 14th, 15th, I think. Around that time, that's when they arrived. But I've taken so much time to do this video because I've been really, really busy starting the new year on a good footing, you know. A proper footing where you're working hard and not just slagging around. So, um, yeah, I'm here with another ASOS haul and I'm so glad that you joined me in this video. Actually, these are mostly makeup and uh, beauty products, not clothes, kama kawaida. Of course, I bought some items of clothing and they came in a carton, a carton that was squashed. I did open the carton as you can see. Yeah, but the, the carton was severely squished. Yeah, it was squished. <laughs> hey. Yeah, but anyway, for as long as the, good, the goods arrived in good condition. Yes, most of these goods, I haven't opened them actually. But let's just proceed. So inside the box, you get like some stickers. Oh, they're not stickers. They're just like, I think, let me see. Order summaries, yes. So these are my order summaries. Just so that in case anything is missing, you can know and ask for a refund. Yes. So uh look at all these goodies that i got guys so stay tuned and um yeah in case you're wondering how i normally ship through asos i normally just ship via post office basically to my postal address that's it but in case you're you you, you know you're not the kind of person who has patience like me <laughs> you can use a shipping agent i hope i will find shipping agents that i can link in the description box below because i've ever used shipping agents before yes so uh -huh. we have um let me just pull out stuff oh actually the first thing that i got i'm going to pull out is a pair of jeans you guys know that i'm super tall i'm five foot ten just for reference i'm five foot ten so getting jeans in kenya is actually a problem and i have ever purchased these jeans before in a different size because they were super stretchy they're just collusion jeans as you can see they come with like tag written collusion uh these jeans uh, they're just like jeggings sort of but the reason i really love them is that they're super 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 comfortable like i know the white like pants and all are in season and stuff like that but i told you i'm a millennial i'm gonna do it <laughs> yeah not now at least yeah but they are super comfortable like these jeans are comfort they're called the um, collusion tall times zero zero two super skinny high waist jean in dark blue wash hopefully i'm just gonna insert an image of how they're supposed to look right there on the model Probably how they look on me yes um so i really love them i hope that they'll fit uh the reason i got another pair was because i had previously bought a size 32 leg 36 which is usually my normal size but for these jeans i they were too, too I sized big. all the way down to a size 28 i've never worn a 28 my entire life maybe in primary school and leg 38 so hopefully they'll fit me they look pretty long but i love them so much so i had to reorder next is also something i've ever bought before <laughs> i think i was just reordering things but guys believe you me when you see me reordering something know that it is that good yes so um i got i actually bought a reordered address so it's like this and this is the asos design tall square neck bodycon in rib natural i think you guys if you haven't if, if you haven't seen my previous asos haul i think i'm just going to uh tag it somewhere there yeah somewhere there or um i'm going to link it in the description box below so you can definitely check it out i 
I bought this dress like in was it in December not December in November yeah around November last year I got this dress but in a different color and it is a tall square neck bodycon and guys if you don't know square necks are some of the most elegant necklines you can never get out there it's a really elegant neckline so if you're the kind who like has problems with necklines flattering you most of the time the square neckline will flatter you whether you, you're small busted or big busted or whatever uh, but it just looks like this it's just a very simple dress but it was super comfortable super 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 comfortable and super affordable super affordable so i just decided to repurchase it in a different color the color that i bought before was blue so i decided to get it in the natural color which is like brown yes and i'm just gonna insert for you of course the image right here of how it's supposed to look on the model and probably a video of how it's on supposed me. to look yes <laughs> Yeah, but I really love them. I can't wait to try them out. Looks pretty decent. Looks pretty fly. Oh, yes. I bought this dress in a size 10, which is the same size that I bought previously. And what I can tell you guys is that anytime you're buying online, make sure you read the reviews. The reviews will tell you whether to size up, to size down, or just buy your normal size. Now, for this one, I size down because I'm a normal size 12. But the previous one, I'd size down because the reviews said it was big, which is true. This side, this dress, particular dress is kind of big, so I size. Also, down. in case you're interested in any any of these things, make sure to check out my description box. Definitely, I'm going to link them in the description box below. Yeah. So now we are moving on to the beauty products. I bought a couple of beauty products, if I can remember, because I ordered these things. I think very late November or early December. Yes. Yeah, but anyway we've moved on from that issue so let's just get into the stuff uh the next things i'm going to pull out is this oils they are oils do i call them oils creams moisturizers yes mafuta mm -hmm. and the first one that i got is actually the it looks like this mm -hmm. i haven't opened it at all so i'm just gonna open it see how it looks on the inside This one it just looks like this as you can see it's still sealed it's the l'oreal paris triple active day 24 hour moisturizer so it's the triple active their triple active range uh 24 hour day moisturizer um i currently don't have a daytime moisturizer to be honest i've just been using stuff <laughs> yeah i've been using stuff and a night cream so i had bought this and it just says it has oh it's for dry to very dry skin intense hydrating moisturizer wow i don't know whether i have dry skin i doubt but it's for dry to very dry skin so it just says hydrate protect and nourish i usually like l'oreal stuff i've used the um, revital lift range and it was really really good so i decided to try out this other one because it was super affordable and i hope it's going to work well on my skin yes that is the first moisturizer that i got and then next we got a night cream because i like pairing like the same brand of day cream with night cream currently i've been using the nivea what was it called the one i featured in my favorites video it's called the nivea um q10 yeah night moisturizer that's the one i've currently been using that has made my skin so good um so right now i'm using i want to start using this triple active comforting moisturizer night let me just confirm if it's the one i ordered yeah it's the l'oreal paris triple, triple active 24 hour comforting night cream so it's still on the triple active range so it's the comforting moisturizer night and it just says hydrate protect regenerate it has glycerin and ceramide so i'm very excited to try it out and it just says that when you use this skin is immediately hmm? immediately like the first first thing you'll see it's immediately hydrated then the texture uh or i guess they're just describing the texture of the moisturizer because they're just saying that it's silky soft without sticking which is good nobody wants a sticky moisturizer yeah apply daily so i'm very excited and it still has the seal as you can see 
very standard l'oreal packaging very nice can't wait to try them out and see how they will take my skin ah, this skin of mine if it could sue me for abusing it using different products all the time anytime it would sue me okay so guys i'm assuming those are the only two skin products skincare products that i purchased now to makeup i did purchase a ton of makeup that was supposed to be used during christmas time well we are gonna use it for valentine's period too bad i guess we're just going to use that makeup for valentine's period period yeah so the first thing that i got is this nyx uh wonder stick now i don't have a highlight and contour stick i do have a like a shiny highlighter that i really don't like and most of the time i just use concealer as highlighter yeah so i decided that i need this highlight and contour stick i had a previous one and i just got it in the shade universal because the other colors were like only the light ones had remained that were like for uh lighter skin than mine way lighter uh so i decided to just get the one marked as universal uh let's hope that it will work for me it's still sealed it just looks like this as you can see the packaging was kind of squished stuff was squished but thank god it arrived yeah so um it's a highlight and contour stick so which means one end is a contour and i also don't have a contour um stick so i decided to get it and ah i used to have this thing and then i don't know it broke and me and broken makeup are not good friends so i just discarded it uh inside god it's a bit difficult to get out it's wrapped also in like form standard uh contour stick and one end i'm just hoping these colors are going to match my skin because one end is like this is the contour shade i believe it looks really light Okay, so this is the contour shade, although they say it's universal, but um, I don't know if the camera can see, it looks really, really light. So, contouring with this, I don't know. But they said it's universal, so let's hope it's gonna work. Ah, damn. And then the highlight side is this which looks really light but again let's hope it's gonna work it will just mean that i'll have to like use it for my nose only or something of the sort because it looks really really light not gonna lie looks way too light because this is just the, like this is the highlight and this is the contour as you can see the contour shade is still lighter than my skin as you can see yeah so good luck with me for me but anyway um probably i'll insert for you the price right there i'm gonna link for you the product in the description box also in case you want to purchase the product i'm going to link it in the description box so asos does have a wide variety of stuff on their website like it has a lot of stuff on their website so you can take your pick they have beauty products skincare products clothing shoes bags you name it even designer items they have so it's a good website if you're into that okay next on our list of stuff um we have this, this one came in a bubble wrap it's also from nyx uh nyx company so it's the nyx professional makeup high glass illuminating powder in the shade golden hour so it's an it, it's a highlighter basically in the shade golden hour by nyx and it's just tiny kind of i know it doesn't look so tiny but it's it's a bit tiny it's tinier than normal yeah but i hope that it will do well i mean there's no point of having excess highlighter i don't know whether it's sealed with yes it is sealed because i want to test it out I'm just gonna link for you guys like the picture there how it's supposed to look try and swatch it for you guys first and hope for the best yes i really love asos by the way guys if you haven't shopped from asos i suggest that you try it because consider if you're tall if you're tall like me try it their tall section clothes are really flattering on tall people they are not those like 
you buy tall clothes and then they are wide because they are tall you no know? like they are really nice and really good and also they ship to kenya for free if you reach 55 pounds yes <laughs> you're given free shipping imagine guys literally kenya has been given free shipping by asos when you reach 55 pounds so why not use that opportunity 55 pounds is like 7k i'm a 6k or something of the sort so i'm trying to open this and it's giving me a headache it's like trying to open those oh god lady gatings i know kids kids won't understand what a lady gatine is <laughs> or those nivea teens eh? okay it's it's really tough let me not break it so finally open. i've opened it as you can see it just looks like that you know anything that sounds like golden hour let me just try and like this tiny brush just, maybe i need to use a bigger brush okay there's something like i've used highlighter so it's worth it huh? yes because you know nowadays we are not into that early not early 2000s 2010s highlighter look that was so crazy like you could just tell so as you can see it's there it's there it's there guys in fact i've put a lot yeah so it just looks dewy and really really nice really natural like doesn't look fake yeah i've swatched it also on my fingers you can see it came off really easily you know after swatching is when i realized that it's been applying all along is it that i got and i was buying stuff that i actually don't have you guys know that i've been using the maybelline um what is it called ah forgotten but she was in the shade molten gold a highlighter and that highlighter broke and i only had one highlighter literally in my makeup collection and it broke so i just had to buy another one seek one a choice yeah and i decided let me try another company another brand yeah so i decided to go for nyx and uh yes let's move on to the next so while i was basically on the asos website i also saw makeup uh eyeshadow palettes and i was like why not why not buy an eyeshadow palette and i bought these ones from makeup revolution and they were super super affordable i think they were like five pounds or something of the sort uh and this one is just like colored so they are just like mattes yes matte shades and as you know at my age right now um i'm not supposed to be using shimmer shades per se because um my skin has fine lines like crow's feet and stuff <laughs> yeah so i decided to pick this makeup revolution one and it just has matte shades that are really pretty the yellows you guys know i love yellow um the oranges the pinkish blue black white you know really nice simple palette so i decided to pick it up and this is their what palette let me see this is their um okay it's the revolution reloaded palette in marvelous mattes yeah so that's the name of the palette revolution reloaded palette in marvelous mattes so let me just try and swatch and see if these colors are actually worth it because i haven't swatched them at all okay it's sealed so let me just swatch this pink one oh as you can see the color came off so easily the yellow the yellow is right there as you can see the colors came off so easily yeah really nice i hope it's gonna be worth it so what a good decent white yes yeah, you can see the colors are really really okay 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 they're okay they're okay they're it's good it's good yeah i'm one person who rarely buys palettes and i haven't been seeing palettes i haven't yeah i only have i think one decent palette to be honest you're buying from me so honestly harry because if you imagine 55 pounds and you're given free shipping i don't think there's any other company that does that for kenyans no i don't think so yeah so um next we have this cute one that was supposed to be for christmas it was even supposed to be a gift to somebody um 
okay we have this really really cute it's so cute like if you see it in real life and really really heavy eyeshadow palette yeah so it's the i heart revolution turkish delight chocolate eyeshadow palette uh and it is it was so good for like christmas looks and stuff although i had bought it actually i wanted to serve it to somebody to give it to someone just look at that it's really heavy really cute i love it Woo! the colors the screen is not even getting the colors properly so you just open it and just look at those ah look at those colors okay it has a okay i've covered the mirror nicely now just look at these colors wow what this one Rita. oh i'll be using a lot of this <laughs> and this and this and this oh this is a very very rare color guys this this weird pistachio thing very rare color and this i love it so pretty so well love it yeah so i'm pretty excited now christmas is over so i'll just keep it for myself <laughs> so i really was excited to buy this one because i saw on in the images the colors were so so pretty and they did not disappoint they're very very pretty so it's their turkish delights i had revolution love it i don't have storage for all this makeup to be honest I don't have cabinets that can store makeup properly. I really have to invest. I don't in know, that. guys, if it's just me or I don't know. Talking a lot makes me really, really tired. And considering I took a break like in January, yeah, in January I didn't film at all. Um, like in January and late December, like from New Year's, I didn't film at all. I'm kind of tired. It's like I need water. I need CPR. I need resuscitation. I'm tired. I'm tired of it. But for you guys, I'm going to share this stuff. Okay, my son is in the room. Okay. Yeah, so anyway, the next thing that I actually got is also... Um, stop! I'm filming. got were also like uh makeup products i got a bronzer from revolution again and it's so big i didn't know this bronzer will be this big this is a really really big bronzer just for for you to get perspective this is the highlighter <laughs> just get perspective this is the nyx highlighter this is the bronzer just look at that <laughs> look at that like side to side so basically, um, this is the, what is it called? And I got the shade dark because I just didn't want to risk. Yeah. So dark looks pretty good for my skin. Oh, so uh, basically this bronzer is in the shade 4, which is dark. And of course, I'm going to test it out for you. Guys. Then, okay, I can't see a mirror, so I'm just going to like try and blend out this. This is, is quite good. Mm -hmm. It's okay. From what I can see, it's like it's good. As you guys can see, it's really done something for this forehead. Oh, that is the next thing that I got. Woo! I think I'll be shopping on this or small because I am just in love with the fact that I could actually get clothing and makeup on the same website and like different brands of makeup not one brand of makeup last but definitely not the least i had to fight with my son over this just a minute ago is this <laughs> i know you guys are thinking like why are you buying colors like what's wrong <laughs> it's not colors this is makeup this is makeup um it's by the brand crayola yeah so they do have this like color trios it says limited edition i don't know whether it's really that limited but so they look exactly just like crayons basically but they are lipsticks and these are called the crayola color trio 
or Crayola color crayon to your wild fruits lips and cheeks so this double up that's why I got them as lip colors and also as cheek colors and you guys have been seeing like I've been trying some crazy makeup tutorials like the fruit series that I tried and I thought this would be really good so I'm gonna try it as a blush because they've said lip okay let me just swatch for you guys although it does look like it can fall so you have to be really careful with this because when it smashes it is smashed <laughs> yeah so it looks I don't know if I should just go all the way and see how much is in there <laughs> yeah, it's a lot it's a lot I'll really make some good use of this it's quite a lot I'm gonna try and return it's gonna return yeah, it's returning nicely so I just got this this specific one um, is like yeah wild fruits so there's this like burgundy one like a pinkish red and like an orange yeah so let me just try and swatch it for you guys like here oh they are so creamy ah, they are so creamy let me try it as a blush because they said lip and cheek okay i'll just put too much what am i gonna lose why did i do that <laughs> why did i do that oh yes oh yes oh yes seeing <gasps> oh yes it's really good i give it a 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 and the fact that you can also apply it on your lips oh yes in fact i've already booked this color as my blush what is that see really messy really really messy so messy but they were really affordable oh yes love it love it and maybe just to add some lip color and the last one is this one which is also really cute ah oh, they are good mm. they are good guys they are good <laughs> worth my money worth my money yeah so basically that is it guys i hope you enjoyed this asos haul did i really film the yeah okay i hope you enjoyed this asos haul if you're not yet subscribed to my channel i normally do a lot of first of all before i even go there just know that all these products all of them unless the ones that are sold out which before i edit the video i wouldn't know but unless the ones that are sold out everything is going to be linked in the description box below the description box if you want to purchase them definitely purchase them this video is not sponsored at all everything i purchased with my own cash my own moolah and um another thing i can say is that i'm going to remind you again asos once you reach 55 pounds which is like 7k or something of the sort free shipping to kenya like who doesn't want such a deal so the only thing i paid was customs which was a match because the value of the goods also was a match you know customs also goes with the value of the goods the type of goods and all that try shipping from asos because their stuff is really good and if you're not yet subscribed just know that i have a lot of videos that are holds for clothes for makeup for jumia for asos for you name it they are there but thank you so much guys for persevering honestly we reached this point in the video even i myself i'm like struggling to talk and i've reached this point in the video so <laughs> if you've reached this point in the video you're much much appreciated continue being your fabulous self 2022 is your year and um even the years ahead of you are massive and great yeah so don't forget to subscribe uh don't forget to like I only did like five likes like five likes on me much appreciated and i'll see you in my next video so bye bye